The bat symbol. Pretty dizzy. I think they went a little bit overboard on the spinning, but still it's a pretty cool effect. So just hit start. Sunsoft. High quality. Good options. And then you could switch between normal hard mode. Seven guys. Let's just start. Gotham City Street. We all know. We've all seen the movie. We don't need to know the plot. It, it follows it somewhat pretty good. The, um, the plot to the movie. This is pretty much just like an introduction, introductory level type thing. You only got to hit these guys a couple times. Look at that. The rain. Beautiful graphics. Beautiful. I think his his bat suit is probably waterproof. I mean, you'd think he went to the all the effort to create such an elaborate suit. You'd figure, like, hey, you know, let's make it waterproof. We are in the mean streets of Gotham City, and it has been known to rain. That tight leather suit probably actually does pretty good with uh, blocking the rain, making uh, make letting the bat stay relatively dry during the uh, winter months. In the summer, though, you'd figure that his suit would get super hot. But once again, you know, with all his gadgets and stuff, you'd figure that he would, you know, find a way to keep himself nice and cool during the summer. But, I don't know, these are just speculations, details that only the utmost enthusiast can speculate on. I think this is by far the hardest fight in the entire game. They made the first boss, like, super hard. Like, he's- it's just the- the way- Ugh. Okay, you know what? Alright, I'll do this then. All day long, dude. I'll just waste them all. Actually, now we could kind of play around. I shouldn't have wasted all that stuff, but it's like, for the most part, you gotta jump behind him and then punch him. Oh, he's gonna hurt me. Yeah, screw this, man, I'm getting that. I'm just wasting these. You gotta jump behind him. We gotta find him again later on in the game. But, like, it's... <sighs> you know. So there's a chemical thing. There's like a boss rush later on in the game. Take out these slideys. Uh oh. Of course we get hit. And why shouldn't we? Ah! Okay, go up here. And you gotta double jump, it's funny. Like, the first time I played the game, I'm like, what? How do you get past that? I got, I just got stuck on it. Of course we get hit again. Because why shouldn't we? I'm gonna die, man. I hate this game. This game sucks. Worst game I ever played in my life. <clears throat> Rookie mistakes. Get up here. And we can just wait for him, man. Sure, fire your rocket. I'll wait. So there's a uh, there's a heart coming up on there, and the hearts are good because they fill all your life up. If you die, like you only start with a small amount of health. So there it is, right over here. Oh, really? Yeah? You want to hit me? It's okay. Because now we have a fresh bar. And every time you die, you're, you're, you get five of the Batarang things. Okay, so let's drop down. Uh-oh. Okay, there we are. And the game loves to... Like, it seems like when you get a lot of the, uh, boomerang things up, that's when you die. Because then you lose all of them. So if I died right now, I would come back with only five.
Not today. Well, I guess... I guess it was today. But that's okay. Let's go up here. Just gonna waste all of them. I don't care. I don't care about nothing. Just get out of here. Okay, so here is... Uh-oh. That's bad. There we go. Let's just take him out. I'll just take damage. It's kind of hard to miss the shots, but if we had enough the batterings, we could take the bottom guy out. We could have jumped up, hit the gun, and then jumped over and knocked Nappy Air off. Napia Air Escargo. I'm gonna get hit. Nope. Whoops. Oh, we wasted one. Great. Stupid. Now I'm out. And this guy right here, man. Th those guys are annoying. Look at they take a thousand hits. I hate this game. I'm gonna die because of that. Now you're gonna... Okay. Small little jump. And then you can just walk over these. Foolish decisions, man. In the game of Batman. Whoops. Not today, dude. Yep. Of course we get hit. And why shouldn't we? That guy, the reason I wasted all that stuff is he could easily knock you off. And you'll just die, you know? Nope, I'm coming for you now, dude. Shouldn't have made the mistake. I think I can actually jump up on there. There we are. Okay. We gotta wait till this thing goes down, yeah, because you could hit your head on that. I'm dead. I hate this game, man. Stupid stuff like that. It's gonna cost me everything. See? Stupid stuff like this. But well, look at that. I'm back, baby. Oh, let's just take a thousand hits.
we can actually wait over here. I suggest just taking that guy out with the batarangs. He's weird. So here comes the real boss. So he'll throw the thing at you. Oh, okay. So just wait. Hit him. He's actually pretty easy. Here comes a tough level. I think it's the uh, car level. And it's... It's pretty hard, man. I'm not gonna lie. Stay on the top part, because you can get, I think, a heart person. Yeah, good. See, we got fresh health now. And then, also, stay on the top, too, because there's gonna be a, like, little batarang things that we can get that's really going to help out. There it is. 11. And then stay on the top too as well because there's going to be more coming up. Another battering thing coming up. Use your uh, your missiles. I think there's gonna be another one coming up pretty soon. What? I need him. Oh yes, good. We got him. Oh, great. Taking damage. I think we actually now need to go to the bottom. Because there's uh, one coming up. On the bottom. A little boomerang thing. Whoops. Yes. I'm back. stuff coming up. I think there's another one. Where is it? It's a it's a kind of a tricky one. Yeah, I think it's coming up here. I'm just gonna waste them. Waste this. Yep, because I knew that was gonna be coming. Okay. Sometimes it's easier to just waste your things other than, oh, look, I'm gonna try to destroy this and not be able to do it. Oh, see? Okay. Three. We'll, we'll probably die. That's okay. Yeah, now we're definitely gonna die. Because now here comes the boss and we don't have any little bombs. I mean, we do, but like, we might as well not even, I mean, you gotta watch out for the little things. Does he? Yep, see? Those are the dangerous ones. Well, actually, the dangerous ones are the, is that little spread shot he's doing. Come on. Yes. Oh, what? <laughs> he killed. Hey, we made it. That was interesting. We died right at the end. Cool. So these guys are tricky because they, they'll do a little backflip jump thing. Everybody dies. Screw it, man. Not worth it. Except for they're going to follow me. 
forever for the rest of my life. Yeah, we're gonna die. That's alright. Because there's a thing coming up. So, it's important that you hit them right when they land or it'll go right through them. That was the stupidest mistake of my life. Don't. Oh, I'm like, oh no. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Cool. Oh no. We gotta... That was stupid of me. Okay, jump off and... Okay, good. So we. this is a, a, a secret to where you can just get all your lives back. See, each time we jump off, we lose a guy, but we gain two. So just keep getting this until we get nine. Well, we'll get eight. Okay, so right here, now we don't need to jump off anymore. Really? I'm just gonna jump. See what happens. And then jump. Here's... Oh, this guy's a knucklehead. Yeah. Oh, this guy's easy. Oh, you gotta... It takes a while, but this is just a safe route. Just stay right here and just jump over him and punch him. That's all you gotta do. So with each punch, it, it it takes two hits to get one of the bars down. So you got to hit them quite a bit. But it's just easy just to hear. There's a faster way to beat him. But like, this is just the safe route. It's best just to take the safe route. There we go. Look at him speed walk. With all the ladies in the neighborhood. Get their heart rate up. This is kind of a, a tough level. Yeah. Those missiles will definitely you know See, why? How do we only have seven? I'm just gonna use them. I don't care. I don't care about nothing. Maybe I should. I mean, they're easy to take out, but like... Oh, look at that! We missed out! Uh-oh. That's all right. I wanted to die. What? Oh, it took away one of our lives. That sucks. Gotham Cathedral. This is a tough level. There's just a million guys. Really? Yeah, see, here's the part where you usually die. 
because... Now you have all the 14 saved up. It means nothing. I think the worst part is... Dying with a bunch of... What's it called? Oh, look at that. I'm back, baby. I'll just waste them because I don't want to die with a bunch of the boomerangs. Well, I guess I'm not going to die. We're actually doing pretty decent, if you really want to get technical about it. Wait for these knuckleheads. I think we get an extra guy coming up, maybe? Pretty soon. Yeah, here it is. Because here's the boss. That. Whoops. Just knee him. But, like... Sometimes it hits you instead. See? Like, what is going on, man? Ooh. Nice. No, not today, dude. Come on. There we are. I wouldn't mind a heart. I don't think we're going to get it. That fire will drain your health, so just take your time. And here comes that one dude. Remember the first boss that we had to deal with? Yeah, this guy. Alright, dude. I'll make it rain. Waste them all on you. Stupid. Of course we get hit. That sucks, man. Could at least give you like a heart or something. Ah, oh, him! Alright, yeah, just wait right here. Then we can just deal with him appropriately. And then there is, after this guy, it's the, um, what's it called? It's the, it's the, uh, the jumpy guy that holds the boombox. Remember in the movie? <laughs> They're playing that Prince song. I think that's the guy, the bald guy. Or the Joker's wearing that raspberry beret. Okay.
Okay. I think that's it. Yeah, we can leave now. This, so you gotta watch out right here. Hit him. You gotta be careful on these ledges. Not today, dude. Okay, wait for the fire to go. Jump over it. Oh, okay. It's hard, man. Uh-oh. <laughs> you can actually get quite a bit of things if you just keep dropping down. But I don't recommend it. So right here, it's careful. Just drop down and hit him. It's so easy to accidentally drop down from here. And you will lose a lot of your progress. Now hit this before that thing falls. I'll take that. Ah! Stick damage. How do we get up from there? Come on. Oh, okay, we just go straight up. We're going to take a lot of damage here. All right, because here's the end. All right, here's the boss with the Joker. Just unleash all your stuff on him. Watch out for those, because that's instant death. You can just unleash on him. That's not very fun. I'd rather hurt him. I'd rather sweep him. But anyways, this is uh, that's the end kind of a tricky little last section on it especially the bombs i feel that the bombs are the hardest part to dodge joker slammed down to the ground from the top of the cathedral something about his teeth sticking out or something isn't he giggling in the movie something like that yeah so here is all the uh credits and stuff they did a pretty good job on the music they did a nice overall dark theme to it I, um, I don't really like his jump. And especially, like, a lot of the boss fights, all you have to do is, like, jump over them and then turn around and hit them. That's not very fun. It's not a very rewarding battle. Um, the hitboxes are a little bit weird, too, and, like, 
that whole jump move that he does like sometimes it hurts the the enemy but sometimes it hurts you it's it's not very consistent so that's what i really didn't like about it so i'd say the the worst part of this i like the like the stage designs are really good they have some secrets in it and stuff like that um but i think that like the worst part about it was the uh controls but the controls aren't really that bad it's just kind of they probably could have done a, a better job at um overall like his attacks and stuff like that it's uh the game is very uh it it it's very generous with the way that it rewards you with like five batarangs but i think they're a little bit overpowered um stuff like that it's cool that they had the the driving level and the shooter level that's uh breaks up some of the uh repetitiveness or whatever it just makes an overall more fun game i think the, the nes game is a lot more fun but uh this is pretty good this is a pretty darn good batman game i say it's pretty much top three this one the genesis and the sega master system no no this is the genesis one i'd say the genesis i'd say the nes one's good uh this one's good the Genesis one and the uh, Sega Master System one is uh, pretty fun. So anyways, yeah, Batman for the Sega Genesis. Thanks for watching. Cue the music.